I'm going to survive 100 days on a raft in hardcore Minecraft. In this challenge, I'm surrounded by a bunch of items floating on the ocean surface. And amongst this floating loot, I'll have the chance to retrieve special items that will help me survive. Like this fishing rod. So on day one, I started the day hooking and grabbing the floating items. I caught some stones, some leaves, and I also found this barrel. Now, I assume if I put this down inside it... Oh, okay. That seems like some crazy luck at the start. We got some iron ores, iron nuggets, some food. This seems way too good to be true. Thank you, Minecraft gods. I'm going to keep the barrel here because it aesthetically improves the raft, which is pretty cool. Now it's a real raft. Also, I've noticed that the durability on this fishing rod seems to be infinite. Is it going to last me forever, which is pretty neat. There's not much else I can do right now other than just keep throwing my fishing rod into the ocean and bringing the items back into my inventory. Now, I wonder if as the days go by, the items that float improve because it looks like the spawn rate is pretty low and if I want to start building my base up, it's going to take a while. But we're in it for the long game. We don't mess around. Now, I wonder if I can actually jump in the water. Is it going to hurt me? Okay. Okay, cool. I don't die in the water. Wait, Barrel, come to me. What do you carry? Oh, let's go. Okay. Fish, dirt. This is perfect. Oh, wow. Let's straight away lay down some dirt. And we'll pop a little bit of dirt here and place a sapling. Do I have enough wood to make a crafting table yet? No. Can't make any bone meal either. Let's see if we can... Is there any wood out here? Damn, no. Yeah, items are pretty scarce. I'm quickly realizing this challenge is going to be a lot harder than I anticipated. And the sun's going down. Oh, what if this drowned, bro? I'm so vulnerable. Please grow. Please. You know what would be perfect on a raft right now? A sweet hoe. Yeah, I need a hoe right now. Because then if I can hoe this up, I can plant my carrots and we'll have a sustainable source of food. <gasps> more items. Grab some more cobblestone. Hop back up on this. How much wood do I have now? Hey, we have a crafting table, but no resources to actually use you. But do not worry. I'm sure tonight things will spawn. Now, string is going to prove quite useful out here. With enough string, I can make wool. And with wool, I can make a bed. And it would be nice to sleep upon this raft. Damn, looks like our luck with the barrels has run out. Yes. Oh, a barrel. Come to me. Praise the holy barrel. Boop. What we got? Wood, string, iron. Oh, and more saplings. Well, it's safe to say I'm not going to struggle for wood at all when that grows. Speaking of growing... Come on, do your thing. Okay, I think I have enough wood now to make a hose. Let's make a couple of sticks. Unos, dos, tres. Woohoo! Okay, I'll plant my two carrots and then let's plant some potatoes too. Grab that. I'm hoping by the end of this challenge that I get a lot better with this fishing rod. Is that what I think it is? It is! The holy barrel. Boop. Oh, this is perfect. Dirt is good. Hoe you up. I love my hoe. Potatoes are going to take me a lot further. Any more dirt? Oh, yes, string. <laughs> you smell that? Yep, that's not my stench from three days without showering planning this video. That, my friend, is a bed on its way. Sheesh, the progress. We'll pop this here. Let's watch the sun come up together. Look at this, guys. We're bonding. Feel that warm glow on my cheeks. Wait, hold up. I feel that warm glow on my cheeks. Let's make a shovel. Right, let's try and find ourselves some dirt. Any dirt around here? Grass, grass. Dirt's on the short side. All right, let's switch up the plans. Let's make a furnace instead. Pop you there. Put coal in you. And then get to smelting some iron. All right. Progress. Uh. Uh. Okay. Yes. Just what we needed. Right, well, first of all, let's get some sticks. Obviously, we'll grab the iron. Cobblestone pickaxe. If I can get underground somehow, that would be perfect. Damn, that tree is taking forever. What kind of sapling did I plant? Have I messed up there? Yes. Oh, let's go. All right, let's collect all this dirt. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Let me just head back to the raft real quick. Hey, the carrots are growing. Is that what I think it is? Oh, it is. As the sun sets on day two, we are rewarded with a barrel. I feel like I want to keep every barrel I collect. I feel like that would be cool. And by the end, we can see how many barrels we were gifted by the Minecraft guards. Okay, what we got? Look at this. Right, we'll put the iron in the furnace, plant an oak sapling. I feel like oak sapling are the ones that grow the quickest. I have a bunch of oak leaves, which you can walk on. Now, let's just use these up. Let's surround my raft with oak leaves. There we go. You know what? Let's spend tonight just fishing. Once we have enough wood, I'll make myself a door. Then that will allow us to mine a little more efficiently underwater. Let's just wait for items. I spent all night sprinting in circles on my leafy padding and fishing for items. I don't know why I do this to myself. As you can see, this is a very slow and painful process. I'm also completely forgetting I can actually use this thing as an actual fishing rod. Like, I can fish. <laughs> I just completely forgot. So, we might get some different items. Let's see what we're getting. Ooh! 
What is this? I have never seen this in my life. What is this? What, is, what are you? Plenty fin. Can I cook you? Oh, I can. Let's find out if this thing kills me. <laughs> Anything that's green has to be poisonous. I guess we'll wait until I'm hungry and we'll chance it and munch on it. I do really need dirt though. Hold the front door. You're a dark oak sapling. You need a bunch of these next to each other for you to grow. Oh, I'm such an idiot. Hey, look at you. Didn't even have to fish for you. Another barrel. Right, what we got? Obsidian, a bunch of coal. Cool. So eventually with enough obsidian, we can head into the nether. As you can see, I have more than enough wood to make some doors now. So that is the ultimate gateway to the next step. Now, where's that ravine? Okay, I found it. Let's find that little dirt patch. Oh, get out of the water. Oh, let's go. Our first tree. I could cry. Boom. Boom. Oh, this is good. This is going to offer plenty of space to grow trees, seeds, food. Create ourselves a little air pocket and we shall shovel all of this dirt. I'm just going to keep going until my shovel breaks. Whilst I'm down here, before I head back, let me grab this iron. Although the barrels do give me this, it's just way quicker if I grab all of this myself. Come back. Hold up. Oh, I thought it was a shark then. That's a dolphin. Don't do me like that, bro. Oh, looks like there's a storm coming. Is that a barrel? That is a barrel. We'll pop you... Here. Right, let's craft ourselves an axe. Grab all of this wood. You all drop a bunch of saplings. And the cycle begins. Let's break this and extend this by quite a large amount. This is only going to be temporary. Boop, 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 boop. And place all of this. Okay, cool. Let's hoe all of this. Oh, hey, buddy. I thought you were a shark earlier. You're lucky I didn't kill you, wherever you are. Ah. Oh. All right, that makes sounds for the rest of the 100 days because you get quite annoying. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> Now, let's fill all this up. You've been great, but you're a little bit annoying. Yeah, I know. But please, I'm trying to I'm trying to make a video here. I'm trying to make 100 days on a raft. It's all right for you. You live here. This is hard for me. Right, let's eat this. Let's eat whatever this is. Okay, I didn't die. Cool. Let's grab these. No, bro, you're making my life harder. Bring that back to me right now, bro. No, I have loads of iron nuggets, so let's make ourselves a bunch of torches. And let's use all of the nuggets I have to make a bunch of lanterns. So we have a little light now. I think we're in a good position here. We got a bunch of trees ready to grow. We got seeds doing their thing. Oh, yes, please. I think the best next thing is to head underground and start going mining. Definitely need to craft myself a sword. I think I might make a chest piece just so it keeps me a little more protected. Grab some food. Let's go look for a cave. We'll make our way down in a little strip mine here. It's like day three. We're finally going mining. I'd feel a lot better if I had a full set of armor on right now, but it's okay. I'm a risk taker. Been a risk taker from birth. Dirt. What is this? An earthworm. Can I eat the worm? I don't know why that's the first thing I thought of, to be fair. <laughs> Not, let's put it back into the wild. It's, can I eat it? <gasps> what is this? I'm in the aether. Oh! Whoa! Hold up. Anybody else see that? I think you did. You and I just saw a minecart with a chest inside. If we keep mining in this direction, I think we may head into a mine shaft. Anybody else find it weird that I have worms in my pocket right now? Nope. Just me. Okay. I'm hearing mobs. We're close. We're close, Captain. I can feel it. Come on. My coffee senses are tingling, bro. Is it above me? Oh, <gasps> what a guess. I don't know how I knew, but I just knew. Oh, no, I forgot to make a shield. Bro, it, it literally occurred to me in that split second. Let's make ourselves a shield. Cool. Can I eat the worm? Oh, I can. I can eat the worm. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh, bro, what did I expect? Right, we learned a valuable lesson today, guys. Don't eat worms. Let's see what we can find. Oh, some blue lapis. We'll grab this coal. All right, let's go. Look at you. We got diamonds, guys. We got diamonds. Bro's lagging. I'm going to kill you, and I'm going to make it quick. What we got in here, then? Gunpowder's always great to have. Name tag, in case we get a villager. Good stuff. Munch on my cooked salmon. All right, let's... Uh... Huh. Okay, I'm not going to need dirt, like, ever again. Oh, oh! Today's a good day. Bro, you can't get me in, a, in any better mood right now. Six diamonds. And all this dirt. Ain't nothing bringing this kid down. I'm in a good mood. Oh, and more worms. Diamonds. Ores. Worms, what a day. Grab this redstone. Are you are you joking me right now? This is the most, oh, this has to be a joke. This is insane luck. 12 diamonds. It's only a mine shaft, bro. This place is like a treasure vault, bro. All right, I think we're done here. Let's hop back down here and let's head back up to the raft. Uh, we'll navigate this maze-like strip mine. Eh, 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 eh. 
And look at that. The trees are growing. It's a very busy raft right now. <laughs> All right, let me break down my next steps for you. I'm going to be collecting as much wood as I humanly possibly can. This will allow me to do two things. Firstly, it will allow me to start extending my raft. And secondly, I'll finally get to build a mob farm. Building a mob farm is an absolute necessity when it comes to challenges like this because it gives me access to a bunch of items. And it saves me time going mining to grab all of the items individually. Whilst I extend the raft on that side, let's plant a bunch of dirt this side and just fill it with trees because the more wood, the better. Let's make this raft nice and big. I don't know how this is going to look. I want to make sure that the original raft stays like a hub for the whole 100 days. I don't know how big I'm going to make this. Now I've squared it off. I kind of want to make it look sort of circular. So from this platform, you'll be able to go in either direction and it will lead you to, I guess, a place of importance, whether it's an enchantment table or storage room, mob farm. I want it all, bro. Oh no. Oh, you're going to be annoying. I really don't want to be dealing with these guys, so I'm going to bed. All right, let's go ahead and make a shovel and finish off this area for like the millionth time let me get a little more wood all right let's use this wood to start working on the build as you can see i've kind of hit a bit of a wall i've run out of building materials the trees aren't growing it's late at night i don't know what to do with myself so i think i'm just going to grab a bunch of sand i think a couple stacks will be more than enough we definitely need to build a mob farm because the bone mill that i'll get from the skeletons in there are going to speed up the process of growing trees big time all right let's turn this sand into glass uh do i have coal yes i have plenty of coal at this point i feel like i should have a counter for the amount of wood i've grabbed let's finish off the first floor on this tower it's just looking better than i anticipated all right let's go ahead and use this glass to fill in the floor then you know what i'm gonna chuck a few lanterns in here for some light all right let's make some ladders pop these here i have loads of string right yeah let's make a bed real quick pop this here all right let's get the second floor finished bro this is a disgusting amount of saplings oh my god it feels so illegal to put them this close to each other <laughs> Oh, God. All right, let's finish up grabbing all this wood, and then we'll work on building the second floor. I'm going to build it about four blocks high because I don't want it to be huge. All right, so second floor done. I'm just missing a roof. Let's make some shears. Let's grab all of this. I'm going to use all these leaves to sort of create a treehouse tower look. I think it'll look really cool. This is kind of cool because the items in the ocean are like spawning underneath my house. I can visibly see the items, so I can decide whether I actually want them or not. I think this looks pretty cool. Before you guys start kicking off, he's cheating! I got these iron ores in a barrel. Let's just put these here temporarily. I will keep them though, like I promised. Let's make a bunch of furnaces. Let's make a sort of kitchen area here. So we have a bunch of furnaces. Oh, my hoe! Yo, baby, I'm so sorry for disrespecting you. Let's turn to my farm. Let's cook the potatoes up. Let's move on to our next job and start working on the mob farm. Oh, barrel. I need stacks and stacks and stacks of materials, so let's go ahead and grab those. Also, I'll definitely be investigating whatever this is later. I'm pretty sure after this, I won't be needing to chop any trees down whatsoever. <laughs> All right, I only need a few more trap doors. Oh, I'm mad hungry. Damn, this weather ain't picking up. Let's put a couple of barrels here, get to them quickly. I can carry the majority of it. It's just a few things I need to put back. Uh, we want to put two double chests down. want to cover those in hoppers. Yeah, nice. Then I got to cover these with slabs. And then you break this block. Yeah, nice. And then we just create the giant tube that the mobs fall down. So we just need to build up 21 more times. So it makes a total of 22 high. All right, let's go ahead and start working on the base of the entire mob farm where the mobs will spawn. Oh, wow. Look how beautiful the ocean looks with the shader pack. Oh, I can't wait to make a boat and get out into that. I still want to know what you are. All right, now the base is done. Let's go and slap a roof on this bad boy. Last thing I need whilst using this mob farm is for a creeper to fall down, explode and kill me. So let's cover the roof in slabs so it stops the mobs from spawning. We need these guys in the giant mob cage. Not outside of it. We have mobs. Oh, we have bones. Oh. We get bone meal from that. I mean, it's only two, but still, it's a star. And another skelly. Wait, where is my shield? You can stay down there. I, I guess you could say you can stay down here and drown. <laughs> Let me feast upon my potato. I came back down here for slabs. Boom, 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 boom. Let me hear you say way ho. <laughs> Let's start slapping down these trap doors so mobs can fall down them. Then we just slap some water in here and this will push the mobs down into the hole. What's happened there? Why has that happened? I'm angry at myself. We should be back in the game, right? Okay, yeah. <laughs> I had too much water. That's why I had four. I'm swapping this wood out for glass blocks because I want to be able to see through here and see if a zombie villager has spawned because, of course, we want villagers on this raft. All right, after all that, let's get some sleep. Look at this. I see mobs. Oh, look at this, guys. Hey, guys. 
Boom. Bones already. That's what we love to see. Some gunpowder. Ah, oh, perfect. Perfect, 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 perfect. Obviously, the most efficient way is just to leave it for a bit and the mobs can stack and then I'll get a bunch of XP and items rather than just sitting there all day. Let's get on to more pressing matters. I mean, I don't know if, if there are any pressing matters. I'm on a raft with literally nothing else to do. However, we got to find a way to get to the stronghold and kill the ender dragon. So for that, my friends, I think it's time we prep for the nether. All right, how much obsidian do we actually have at the moment? Three. We can grab some more of these from the barrels. I still have a bunch of building blocks left over from the farm. Don't need the ladders, don't need the stairs, don't need the trap doors, keep a water bucket. I'm hungry again. Oh, I'm so dumb. I've wasted all my iron making lanterns when I should have made a full set of iron armor. Let's make some trousers and a helmet. Oh, oh, more obsidian. Any barrels under here? Nope. No barrel spawning. All right, let's hope we get a bunch of barrels with a bunch of obsidian in. Maybe removing the items makes space for more to spawn. That would make sense to me. But then again, most things that make sense to me don't make sense at all. How am I not reaching that? Bro, come on. Barrels seem very, very scarce, so it doesn't leave me much choice. Let's head underground and find a lava pool. Grab a bunch of obsidian. Oh, grab some coal while we're here. We were running a little low back on the raft, so it's good to top resources up. A little more iron. Hello, mate. I have such a temptation to remove the pearl from your body, but I'll spare you this once. I seem to have hit the gold mine by just mining straight down. I'm in disbelief. <laughs> Uh, oh, okay. Too close, too close. Don't like that. Looks like we're visiting the nether sooner than I expected. All right, let's go. Oh, oh my God. What am I doing? My pinky finger slipped. <laughs> oh, get in the water, get in the water. I'm going to go for 20 pieces of obsidian because that's way more than I need and I don't really want to be coming back. I have spotted diamonds whilst I was mining the obsidian, so... Come to puppy. All right, before I head back and head into the nether... Oh, look at that. Two diamonds over there. I'm seeing a bunch of diamonds over here. Look, I can't go back just yet. All right. Oh, I messed up. I, I messed up big time. Oh. 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 No, 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 no. Oh, my God. Oh. You know, you're just so stressed. You can't think of words. Let's go back and get those diamonds. Why am I scared? I play this game for a living. Ah. Of all the mobs in this game, skeletons are the worst. If you agree with me, comment. Let's get up to these diamonds. Hey, and the other one. That is so many creepers. Oh my goodness. Nightmare fuel, bro. Oh. Ah! No, not my diamonds. Oh, that was too close for comfort. Let me just grab all these diamonds. Right, let's head back and build ourselves a nether portal. Let's use the diamonds we have collected to make a new axe. Let's build this. One, two, three, four, ten, eleven, twelve. This might look exceptional or absolute dog sh Now let's add the nether portal. Okay, it kind of looks good. It just needs a roof on it. I'm thinking... We <gasps> oh! Yeah, that's cute. Barrel. Let's give this a go. <gasps> ah, okay. All right, well, let's put some other random trees at the back here. Hopefully we get a tall one. Oh, <gasps> that's huge. All right, gravel, 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 gravel. Wonderful. I knew I'd find you. I don't need a diamond shovel. We ain't about that. We live a humble life. Iron shovel. Grab all of this. Turn you on. Lovely. So mobs shouldn't spawn because I covered it in lanterns. All right. Let's get a little more prepared. I mean, diamond armor, diamond weapons. Y'all know the deal. Ooh. Barrel. I got you, buddy. Okay. So now we have a full armor set. And I have enough diamonds to make a diamond sword, which is what we need. Oh, you know what I will do because I can't be bothered with the grief. I need to use that gold to make myself just literally a pair of boots because I don't want to have piglins attacking me. And while we wait for that to do its thing, let's just grab a bunch of food. Hopefully we get a good spawn. Sweet. Well, there's obligatory that we need to grab ourselves some nether quartz while we're here. I guess I'll just kind of like strip mine this way. I can hear little piggy noises. Ah, well, let's dispose of you. So squeaky. <coughs> All right, let's focus up. We've got to find ourselves a fortress, and I'm not seeing one in my vicinity. We're on the same team, bro. I've got gold on. I got the Versace, bro. Let's try not to fall in the lava pit. Let me guys fill you in on the beef. This little piggy went to the wrong market. I'll tell you that now. I am deep in this forest. Hold up. Yeah, I see nether brick. Let's get across here. I'm sticking to treetops because the hoglins will attack me and it stresses me out. My doctor says I got to keep my blood pressure down, so not to do anything that's going to make me like sort of panic. <gasps> We're in. Find ourselves the blaze spawner. Let's go. All right, grab the blaze rod. You don't scare me. All right, we need to find ourselves some nether wall. And then I'm pretty much done with this fortress. Let's check all the way down here. 
Mmm, yeah, this fortress is tiny. There's not even any wither skeletons, you know? It's not even like I can use this place to start gathering heads ready for the wither. This is the most useless fortress I've ever set foot in. We gotta get out of dodge. At least we have blaze rods, so we haven't got to kick around spawners. I've been walking for so long, bro. I cannot find a single th- <gasps> What's that? Oh, it's a bastion. That's not a fortress, it's a bastion. I mean, I guess we don't have a choice. Beats walking on netherrack for like another hour. Let's crack into this bad boy. Please don't fall, please don't fall, please don't fall. All right, let's break our way in. Let's get rid of these guys. Let's get ourselves into the middle. So I've created this barrier because the magma blocks were like jumping up and I don't want the piglins hitting me with their crossbows. These guys pack a punch, so I have to be as careful as possible. There we go. Is that all of them? All right, now we're talking. We got some good loot. Ooh, I didn't even notice that. We got another ingot. And of course, we have all of this gold to grab. You know what? Let's eat this pork chop. A little bit more substance to it. A little bit more spice. Why are these guys going crazy for? Oh, we have loot. What do we got? Ancient debris. Yes, please. All right, let's get out of here. Let's find that fortress, wherever it is. I have not seen a fortress for a very long time. All I need it for is nether wall. If even a chest somewhere could just give it to me, that would be fantastic. There we go. All right, let's crack into this bad boy. I already have the blaze rod. I just need the nether wall. Oh, of course. I'm not going to pass up any loot. All right. Now we're talking. Here's the room that I care about. All right. Let's get out of here. Where's all of the endermen? I need the pearls. They spawn in these biomes, right? Oh, there's one. I heard him teleport. There he is. <gasps> My shield broke. Oh. I do not want to be out here with no shield. You know what? I have so many materials in my inventory. Let me store everything back at home on the raft because I'm sick and tired of having to ration everything. Right, let's make a boat. We'll make another shield. And now we can finally grab ourselves some pearls. I've done what needs to be done. Without their sacrifice, I would have never been able to survive on my raft. That's what I'm telling myself anyway. Let's go back home and I'll cry myself to sleep with guilt. All right, cool beans. All right, let's stick all the important things in this chest by my bed. So we have the blaze rod, all the pearls we collected. That's pretty much it, isn't it, for the ender dragon. I'll also grab the ancient debris and netherite. Put it in there. I don't know what to make. Do I make a netherite pickaxe, netherite sword? I'll think about it. In the meantime, though, let's sort all of this out. Before killing the ender dragon, I just want to take this day to improve the raft. We'll grab these last few logs, pick up this sapling, and start making some improvements. First of all, let's make these bridges, actual bridges with, you know, light and prevention from falling into the ocean. I'll even do it for the mob farm, too. Sheesh, look at the amount of mobs in the mob farm. I want all of your XP, thank you. All right, now I'm done with the raft improvements. I'm finally gonna jump in this boat and go check this thing out. I put it off for too long, let's see what we got. Hopefully some good loot. It is literally, it's nothing. It's, it's literally nothing. Absolutely pointless. Not completely pointless though, as I think, oh, hey, okay. My bad, my bad. I almost left then. <laughs> okay, uh. Coal, axe, and a fishing rod. Wow, amazing loot. I need like a ton of glass for an idea back on the raft, so let's just take all this sand. Well, I'm already in the boat and out at sea, so I may as well spend the rest of day 30 exploring the ocean. Although right now, it's not looking like there's anything out here. Oh, hold up. Wait a minute. There's land? Slap my cheeks and call me Uncle Bill. It's a sandy hill. I can get so much glass out of this. Oh, let me break this block. All right, some wheat. Coal. Oh, is that oh, sugar cane? Let's grab this. Let's explore around here just a little longer, then we'll head back. Looks like we got a shipwreck over there. That's a full ship. That ain't even wrecked. Let's have a look. Moss block. Oh, bamboo. Let's go. Carrots, paper. Damn. Okay. This is really, really good loot. Is that it? Is it just the one chest? Let's have a look around. Oh, nope. There's more loot in here. Let's go. Oh. Lots of iron, blue lapis, and a bottle of enchanting, which I'll just throw down. There has to be something else, surely. What is that? Let's make a run for that, eh? More sugar cane? Now, what on earth is this? <gasps> is that a village? That's a villager, bro. What? Two villagers. What? TNT, fire charges, apples? Very random. That's cool, though. Can I take this? Let's grab all these fish bones because they look cool. <laughs> I have absolutely zero way of getting you back home because the boat's all the way over there, and it almost feels like cheating. I gotta do this the right way, guys. I gotta transform a zombie villager. I'll leave you to be. Pleasure doing business with you fellas. Yo, the sun's rising. You've been out here for quite a while. There's my trusty little boat. All right, let's get back to the raft. Home, sweet, floaty home. 
All right, whilst I tend to other jobs, let's get to work putting all this sand in the furnaces and making a bunch of glass. No way. I was literally just about to say that seeing those villagers makes me want a villager. So I was going to sit and wait for a zombie villager, but look at the lot that we have. Do I, I'm just going to break the hopper. Oh, okay, the creepers, the creepers have also escaped. Perfect. And he has a hat on as well. So he's not going to burn in the sun either. Hold up, he's burning in the sun. Quick, come this way, come this way. <sighs> look what look what's happened here. Place my hopper back on there. All right, repair job done. I got so excited. <laughs> Oh, you can't help but laugh in these situations, you know what I mean? Let's sit here and wait for a zombie villager and transform him. Now, you're probably wondering why I haven't gone to the stronghold yet, even though I have everything I need. But I just really want a villager on my raft, bro. I want to go and take on the ender dragon, knowing that there's somebody here to look after things in case I don't make it. You know, the mob spawns dried up, bro. Wow. What can we do while we wait? Let's do something with this. As you notice, I have random barrels just darted everywhere. Zombie villager? Nope. Let's get rid of all of this. All right, now all of the dirt is removed. Let's just pick up the loose pieces. Look at the amount of saplings we have. I am never, ever, ever going to run out of wood on this raft. All right, let's get this finished. Let's keep the circular theme, and I also have to make sure there's space for sugarcane. Look how beautiful those fish are. They glow. I'm sorry, I'm getting distracted, but look at you. Can I capture them? Oh, I can. I'm keeping you. I have a lot more dirt than I thought from all the barrels I'd collected so far. Plus everything that I'd shoveled up from the mine shaft. Plant all this sugar cane down. Plant down a couple of bamboo. Now let's just build a wall around this thing. Let's use a mixture of wood, cobblestone, logs. As you can see, I use the fish burns. Let's get all this sorted and we'll hoe this last chunk. Now, of course, we'll just plant our food. Still waiting on that villager. It's not looking hopeful, but still we have much work to do. I have run into a bit of an issue though. I don't have any trees now except that one. So I think we should probably build a tree farm, otherwise I'm not going to have any wood. Let's start placing the dirt where I'll place the saplings. And let me grab some of this bamboo and add some decoration around this tree farm. Let's grab this bone block, turn it into bone meal, and grow these trees. Oh, okay, sugarcane's growing a little bit quicker than we expected, so let's get all of this down. So we're back in the game when it comes to wood. Let's check on our mob farm. Hold up. <gasps> That's a zombie villager. It is, it is, it is a zombie villager. Okay, we gotta play this cool. This time, I'm gonna build myself some shade. I'm gonna build a boat. Let's just, <laughs> let's just break this. I only need a few more blocks. So if I kill all the mobs and leave, yes, okay, this is working perfectly. I kill all of them, leave the villagers alive. <gasps> no, are you joking? What? You saw what I saw, right? Let's get this guy out of here before anything else spawns. I can't believe that. Over here, bro. Yes, get in that. Yes. All right, good. Let's patch this up. There was two of you. There was two of you. I literally had the best luck on the planet. Minecraft did me dirty. I know for sure I have a name tag. Let's grab enough iron to make an anvil. These big old caves got plenty of ores. You stole my iron from me. I'll take back what's rightfully mine. Thank you. Let's shove all of this iron inside the furnace. I'll take a quick sip of my coffee whilst we wait for this last few pieces of iron to cook up. Ooh, I love it. I love it. I didn't call myself coffee fueled for no reason. I'd be needing that. I'd be needing that coffee to keep me fueled up. If I did a blood test, I'm pretty sure I'd be 80% caffeine. And it's all YouTube's fault. <laughs> Let's grab this iron, make some iron blocks. Uh, that's it, right? How do you make an anvil? It's not like I'm a Minecraft YouTuber or anything. With enough research, I realized I was doing it right. I was just doing it upside down, all right? Give me a break. Slap this down. Now, what do I call this guy? Wilson, because he's the only thing I have with me on this raft. If you get the reference, Fingers crossed I don't get sued. I'm coming, Wilson. Yo, Wilson, look at me. Let's get you in a house, bro. Let's grab some wood. And then I think I'm gonna build Wilson's home right here. Let's get to work. Been a while since I pulled out the old fishing rod. Let's clear this area. First of all, let's get the foundations nice and solid. I laid down four points. At least that gives us a good canvas to work from. <laughs> Bloop. Build up. Obviously, it's going to be connected to the rest of my raft, but I kind of want it to be like an independent like lodge house where the villagers can live in. Now, we just need to fill in this square. All right, now that this has been filled in, I want to have two levels to it. So let's say from here, you climb up 
And then the second level of the floor goes here. I can't believe I'm already running low on wood. That's all I've used on this raft is just so much wood. Yeah, I think we're making a good start. Wilson's gonna love this. Oh, wow. I thought I'd slept. Boys, I'm well rested. I'm a well rested individual. Why are you coming at me, bro? Oh, just you wait until you hear from my lawyer. Well, let me kill you because you dropped phantom membrane and I'm a little bit more equipped to take you boys on now, so. Boop, 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 boop. Triple kill. Let's jump into bed. So I haven't got to deal with them. Make a bunch more slabs and carry on. Let's get this second floor finished. All right, second floor done. So now I'm thinking we build the actual house here. I always build four up. Three, four. Let's join these so the foundations of the house. <gasps> I'm out of logs. Let me grab this. <laughs> Look how bad it looks at the moment. Oh no, I really hope I can turn this around. <laughs> oh no. Day 38, let's get this finished. Let's fill in these walls. And then what if we turn these into strip wood? Yeah, that looks cool. And then fill this in. I'm pretty sure I have loads of glass in a barrel back in the main house. So let's make 32 panes. Let's fill in the windows with glass panes. Oh, Wilson's gonna love this. Nice and cozy. It's coming together. Now my least favorite part of any build, the roof because I'm terrible at building roofs. All right, it's day 40. The build's almost done. I think this looks pretty good. There's just a few things I want to add, like decorations, so we'll go ahead and do that. I have a plant pot, and then I could put maybe like a leaf there. That looks weird, but good at the same time. And then, of course, we can add like a few leafy additions. Makes it look nice. I want to add somewhere I can leave my boat, you know? Like a mini docks or something. <gasps> Is that a barrel? That's a barrel. I haven't seen a barrel in a hot minute. We'll make a bunch of lanterns. And we'll hang one here, one here, a couple on the corners up here, and maybe two on the edge here. Oh, and I have a spare one. Let's put that there. Let's build a bridge right here. I'm terrible at building bridges. Here we go. This looks like I planned it. I didn't. I just kept going and going until I thought it looked good. Like, look, this doesn't even match. But I think that's cool. It's rustic. It's 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 rafty, you know? <laughs> look, come on. I think this is going to be sick. Wilson's going to love this place. Right, now the beds. Let's, let's just make as many beds as we can. Three beds. More than enough. Uh, we'll stick a lantern in here for light. And let's make a little sign. Hmm, I don't know what to name this place. I'll leave it up to you guys. You guys comment below. And then if the video pops off, I'll do another 100 days. And I'll switch out this sign for one lucky winner down in the comments below. So get to commenting. Hello there. Now, of course, all we need to do is make ourselves a brewing stand. Place it over here by the villagers, I think, is a good place for it. Make some glass bottles. Get some blaze powder. Craft myself a golden apple, brown mushroom, nether wart. Ooh, raw pork chop. Yes, please. I just need a spider eye, which I don't think I have. Let's see if the mob farm has a spider eye in it. Hello, lonely creeper. Goodbye, lonely creeper. Oh, hey, Wilson. Uh, nope, no spider eye in there. Damn. We're gonna have to get ourselves a spider eye. I'm sure we'll find a spider down here. Hey, yo, found one. Let's go. Oh, two. Ah, I was not expecting two of you. Hey. Oh, you couldn't ask for better luck than that. Right, let's get out of here. Can't we just talk this out, guys? Okay, fine. Now, the final ingredient we need is a sugar cane for a little sugar. Lovely, jubbly. So let's go ahead and ferment that spider eye. Boom, boom, boom. Easy lemons. And then all we got to do is place the water bottles here, crack some blaze powder in, and then don't I just do this? Hey, okay. And then we just add some gunpowder, make it splash potion a weakness, and then we can finally save this guy. Let's build some shade in case the sun comes up and he's still turning. Let's do this, Wilson. We'll break this. Ow, ow. Damn, Wilson, you do some damage. Slide in here, splash you, and start the process. Cool. We got there in the end. <laughs> <laughs> I've decided Wilson will be a farmer. And then he could do me some pretty sweet deals with emeralds. And then when I get another villager, I'll probably make him mending. I would really like the book of mending. That would be nice. Let's grab some food. Munch, 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 munch. Then grab the ender pearls. And I think it's time we find that stronghold. I don't know how many eyes I'm going to need. So should we just take 10? Do you think 10 will be enough? Hanging in there, Wilson. I was just about to leave. Right, come with me, Wilson. Wilson, come with me. There's a bed up here. Wilson, Wilson, this way. Yes. Jump, Wilson. What's this guy doing? No, this way, bro. Is this guy actually for real? He's for real, isn't he? Yep, okay. You wanna go this way? We'll push you this way. I don't need this right now, Wilson. 
You can't have the main house if that's what you think you're gonna do. Just went to barrels, give jobs. That, that That's not a thing. You can't just make up your own job, Wilson. I'm going to have to literally drag him up there, aren't I? I have an idea. <laughs> it's a really stupid one. But we're gonna give it a go. Let's break all of this. This guy. What is your obsession with barrels? Leave the barrels alone. This way. Oh, this guy is a barrel addict. I'm gonna have to break all the barrels. This guy wants to do everything but go into that house. I'm so confused. There's three beds. Three unbelievably comfy beds. I want to go and kill the ender dragon. Get in this boat. Now there's no way this guy's getting out. Now this way, bro. Now what are you doing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. In there, in there. Yes! Yes, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Job assigned. Bed slept in. All right, now we can go to the stronghold. What do we need to fight the dragon? We have a shield. Armor. Check. A few ender pearls. A water bucket. Slow falling potions. Just because when the dragon hits me into the air, it's just nice knowing that you're gonna slowly fall back to the ground. I'm pretty sure if you put that with redstone, it makes them longer. Yeah, okay, yeah. The very last thing we're gonna need is arrows, so let's grab what the mob farm has. We'll hang around the mob farm for just a little bit, as it's the quickest way to get arrows right now. All right, which way are we going? Oh, this way. Okay, where'd it go? Oh, there it went. Bro, what are you doing? Jump up then. So stupid. What are you doing? Oh, this guy just really doesn't like his home. He's a grown man. He can do what he wants. But when I come home after I've killed the dragon, I definitely got to make sure that no villager can escape. <laughs> All right. Damn, look at the progress we've made. That actually looks good from this angle. Let's go and kill the ender dragon. Still heading in the right direction. That's good. Okay, so it's sending me this way. Hey, look, it's another one of those weird structures. Hey, guys. Hang on. I might be able to sneak you on this boat, you know. Yeah, I'm, I'm taking them home with me. I'll take at least one of them, and then that means we'll have two villagers so we can start breeding. Where are we going? This way? Okay. Boop. Is it around here then? Oh, no, it's this way. Okay. Where did that pearl go? Oh, no. They must be... Oh, 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 okay. So they were flying behind me. Is this where the stronghold is? Oh, hey, buddy. Where's my shield? There it is. Yo. Obviously, I'm not going to turn down ores while I'm down here. Does this go any deeper? Oh, it does. You know what? Let's just start digging straight down here, which I know is kind of illegal, but I want to get this ender dragon out the way so I can get back and finish up my raft because I have a cool idea for a build with the egg, like a fish tank styled build. And you know those really nice glowy fish? Yeah, I'm going to use them. Well, I only have one at the moment, but I'm sure more will spawn. <laughs> hey, okay. That is not where I expected it to be. <laughs> it's a very cursed stronghold, but we're in nonetheless. That's all that matters. Let's try and find that li- <gasps> Is that a library? <gasps> oh, yes, yes, yes. This stronghold is really messed up. Oh, let's go. Gotta love the library. Let's grab a bunch of this so when we make an enchantment table, when we get back, we can get that bad boy to level 30. This is really handy as it's really hard to get leather when you're on a raft. So thank you, Stronghold. You're coming in clutch. I don't need to take every single bookshelf, but I'll take enough. All right, now we just need to find the portal, wherever it is. More iron doors and another library. Okay, let's keep searching. I hear a little silverfish. Hello, guys. Wait. Hey, there you are. Goodbye. I have the perfect amount of ice. No, no, you're joking, bro. How have I done that? There's absolutely no way that's happened. It's got to be up here somewhere. Somewhere. Oh, oh, praise the Lord. That was close. Oh, wow. Only that could have happened to me. Eh, eh, eh. <laughs> okay, don't misclick. There we go. Let's go kill ourselves a dragon. Oh, I'm in a box. I'm in a box. Which way do I go? All of my items are running on such low durability. Bro's playing it risky. Hey, guys. I oh, didn't even look at you, bro. I didn't even look at you. Jump scare alert. Right. Get rid of that one. Drink up the slow falling. Eat the food. Good vantage point. Pop some of these off. My aim has to be dead on because I don't have infinity on my bow. Ah! I can get these, surely. Yeah. And another one. Right. Now we can take out the last crystal. I should be able to reach it from underneath this corner, right? Right, now we just have to kill the dragon. Drink up some more slow falling. Come down. Yes. Yes. There we go. I'm confused. What's happening there? Why is my dragon doing that? Earth to Minecraft. What is happening? What the? I genuinely don't know what to do. What is happening? The... The portal has appeared. There's a way to explore the end, but the dragon's gone. I don't know if anyone else has had this problem, and I don't know if it's because the, like, a mod pack is clashing, or it's the map, but I'd rather just be completely open with you guys and transparent. Honesty is the only way forward, and I'm just gonna be honest with you, I have no clue 
What has happened? Okay, I don't even get any XP out of this. I've gained nothing from this. You saw that, right? She just, the dragon just kept flying up and up and up and then just, I'm, I'm sorry guys, I can't give you the dragon fight that you wanted. No XP, no egg. We have loads of work to do on the raft, so we'll just carry on with what needs to be done. Where's Wilson? Oh no. Wilson? Oh no. He's gone. No, 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 this can't be. This is some seriously back-to-back -back bad luck. Well, I guess what we can do now to cheer ourselves up is make an enchantment table. So huh. What? Yay! <laughs> Boom. Wilson is not going anywhere. Let's keep him safe in that. That's so... Unless he was, like, around here or something? I don't know. First the ender dragon, now this. Right, let's get to work on building an enchantment table. First of all, we'll actually craft the enchantment table. And then we'll grab a bunch of wood. I'll also make the bookshelves in advance, so I don't have to worry about those later. That should be more than enough, I think. 16? Wow, well, we can always make more if we need to. We definitely need to build something better for storage. But in the meantime, let's crack on with the enchantment table build. Make you face me. Break you. Strip you. Grab these slabs. Strip you. All right, cool. I don't know why that bridge is so different to this bridge. I just felt like doing something a little different. In hindsight, I'm just going to stick to my... Uh, <laughs> my original idea because I think that bridge is just a little bit too crazy and a little bit heavy on the resources. Now, I don't want this bridge to be too long. Place these logs, strip those. We build out this way. We could almost connect it with the tree farm. That could work. That'll do. That's as far out as I'm gonna go this side. I'm liking this now because we've been very heavy on the builds this side, but there hasn't really been much going on over here. So I think this is just what we've needed. We'll build out over here. I don't want to go too far out, but I want to make it nice and round. Yeah, this is looking good. This is looking good. I reckon about this far. Now, it may not be even, but I think that's more than enough space for an enchantment table. And then, I don't know, space for an armor stand or something. I don't know. <laughs> Let's get this filled in. All right, now I want to build a roof on this thing. So these are in line. I just need to do one more pillar. I'm going to leave the sides open. I kind of just only fence it in. I think it'll look really nice. So, let's get this roof finished. All right, let's light this place up. Slap some fences down. I don't know whether to just keep that open because it looks so nice. You can watch the sunset from here. That is awesome. Okay, and now what I'll do is I'll throw down these bookshelves. Um, I don't know where the best place for it is. They have to be in a specific order, don't they, for it to work. So, let's make a quick crafting table. Slap that down. Let's just make as many bookcases as we can. Five. Let's grab some blue lapis from these barrels so we can at least test to see what level the enchantment table is. That's not going to work, is it? Let's redo this. All right, let's see how this works. All right, so if I place this last one here and then check to see... All right, finally. Sheesh, that took way too long. Okay, a level 13 enchantment table. Cool, we'll add some bushy leaves around it. Nature, man. Chuck a couple of lanterns in there. I have loads of books and wood, so I can get away with throwing a couple more bookcases in there. Even though they'll only be serving the purpose of being aesthetically pleasing. I don't see a problem with that. There we go. Make it a bit more bushy over here. I'm liking that. Let's make some trap doors. We can make a couple of makeshift benches here. Look like that. Yeah. We'll stick down a random fence post and a pressure plate. That looks like a table, right? And then we'll add like a chair here. Cool. It's all coming together. I like that. We'll think of something to do over here. Let's make a few chests because it's always handy. Oh, that works perfectly. Stick a double chest here and another chair so I can sit out here and do some fishing. Let's turn this chest around. It makes more sense to be facing the ocean. No. There we go. Is that going to look weird? I don't think so. I think that could look quite good. It's art, bro. Don't argue with art. I say we're done. Look at that. That's cool. I think the last thing it's missing is maybe like a just a simple wall. We'll make it out of log. You can see how my mind works when it comes to Minecraft building. It's just do whatever I think looks cool. That looks cool. Oh, I'm gonna drown. Ah! All right. Cool. So enchantment table section complete. I'm also joining these two bridges together. I was getting so tired of having to keep walking around everything where I, I can just cut through here. I'll probably do the same on the other sides too. <laughs> we'll improve on this a little bit later. Ooh, that's satisfying. You know, even though we didn't get the XP from the dragon, I'm getting plenty of XP from this. So it's not all bad news. Let's get some sleep. 
All right, what to do on day 52? Yep, you guessed it. We're gonna enchant my stuff. Let's make a grindstone. That way we can disenchant our items and we'll head back over to the enchantment table and place all of this stuff down. Let's put the amble here. We'll put the stone cutter here. Oh, sorry, that's the grindstone, my bad. Let's grab my armor. Hopefully we get some decent enchants. Let's enchant our chest plate. All right, that's not bad. What are we getting on the pickaxe? Ooh, efficiency, fortune three, and I'm breaking three. That is a amazing pickaxe. Respiration, that's perfect for when you're living out in the ocean. Hold up, let's go get some XP from the mob farm. All right, that should be enough. So let's pick up where we left off. Let's enchant the rest of my armor. Protection, I'll take that. And the boots. Hey, protection. Oh, and depth strider. And then who really cares about the axe? Oh, silk touch. I mean, I can't complain. It's good to have something in your inventory that has silk touch. Right on. Oh, wait. Right on. Next step is to make a lectern and pop it down here. Now we just need another villager so we can get the Book of Mending. I'll sell you potatoes for emeralds, and then I'll have enough to buy the Book of Mending off your buddy. But we gotta get you a buddy first. And rather than wait for a zombie villager, let's craft a boat and head out to where that stronghold was. Because there was a villager there. If you've enjoyed this video so far, don't forget to like and subscribe. We are close. It was just around here somewhere. All right, we're here. This feels so wrong, but I really need another villager, and this seems like the easiest way to get them. Bro, get in my boat. Why is this proving to be so difficult? It's never been this hard. There we go. All right, we got him. All right, home sweet home. I'm hoping you're going to be a little easier to deal with than Wilson was. No, oh, don't you dare. Don't you dare. No, 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 no. If I gotta break the door, I think I have to break the door. Wonderful. And then what do you sell me? I was going to keep doing this till we get mending. Bro's offering every book known to man, apart from the one I want. Come on, bro, you got this. Come on, you got this. Nope. All right, let's see. Yay! Finally! I need you to sell me carrots, Wilson. Okay, carrots. Perfect. So we got carrots for emeralds. Emeralds to buy the mending. Here's a bunch of carrots. Make another baby. Be useful for once. I'm gonna go get some carrots so I can get some emeralds. All right, plenty of carrots. Oh, you know what I do need to grab is the books from the enchantment table area. I'm so chuffed with how this raft is turning out. We still have a little bit of work to do. Oh, sorry, I don't want to wake you up. <laughs> oh, not in front of me, boys. Come on. Tell me when you're done. <laughs> Welcome to the family, buddy. Good job, Wilson. Let's sell some carrots for some emeralds. Keep going. Oh, nearly there. We'll buy the Book of Mending off of you. Let's put my pickaxe with the Book of Mending, and we'll call it something completely original. Here we go. Boom. We'll eventually get Mending on all of this. Let's go into the Nether, grab a bunch of Nether Quartz so we can get XP, because it's a little bit quicker than the Mob Farm. And while we're in here, we shall find that fortress again and get ourselves some Wither Skulls so we can kill the Wither and make a beacon. Lots of jobs on the checklist. First of all, let's grab all this Nether Quartz. Get that XP, boy. Boop, boop, boop. I don't have any gold boots. We must sneak around these guys. Last thing I need is being attacked by a group of piglins. And not because I'm scared or anything. Look, I'm not trapped in the nether with them. They're trapped in the nether with me. Nah, I'm kidding. They terrify me. With this shader pack, this wood honestly looks the bee's knees. Yo, Chad, is this real? All right, all right, all right, all right. I feel uncomfortable eating pork chop in front of these zombified piglins. When that green bar below that pickaxe has disappeared, we'll head over to the fortress. Oh, there's a bunch of XP there. Oh lord, this is bright. This shader pack got me blind right now. I feel like I'm in an Oppenheimer, bro. Uh, oh, my eyes. Ah. <laughs> oh, that's a nice big vein. And there we go. Pickaxe is back in action. Nothing else is almost on its way out. We'll grab some diamonds and repair my armor at some point. I do have another ingot back on the raft as well. I must not forget that. All right, I don't have looting three on my sword, but I do have smite. So killing the weather skeletons should be pretty easy. Oh, too close, too close. I'm seeing a lot of blazes, but I'm not seeing any wither ske... Oh, okay. Ah, no thanks, bro. Oh, yeah. Two hit kills. Oh, there's quite a lot of you, actually. Oh, no. Come on. Nope. Hello, mate. Oh, there's two of you. With a head? Nope. This way, come this way, come this way. Yes. Yeah. Nope. 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 Please drop a head. Please. Yo, what's good, bro? Nope. I really need looting on my sword, evidently. Because these guys are not dropping heads. Oh, are you joking? It looks like we're not having much luck right now with the wither skeletons. So, let's head back. We'll grab some food. 
make a few changes to the raft, and then we'll try again. The beacon could be the last ingredient in this entire recipe. Let's grab some glass. I only have like a stack of 64 glass left, so we'll start placing it here. And then when I run out, we'll just head back over to that sandy hill, and we'll grab a bunch of sand there. Let's make a bunch of shovels. Yeah, that'll do. Let's enchant some of these shovels. Even if I get, I don't know, Oh, there you go. I was going to say efficiency too, so that's perfect. That's better than nothing. Let's make ourselves another boat. And I'm pretty sure, can't you in 1.19 put a chest on a boat? That's a thing, isn't it? Ah, there we go. So we could fill that up with sand. And then fill our inventory up with sand. Yeah, okay, cool. Sweet. Look at that. Little chest boat. I completely forgot you could do that. So that's cool. All right, let's go get ourselves some glass. Well, sand. And then we'll turn it into glass. Ta-da. I pull up at the after party. Bam. Let's get to work. Oh, <laughs> I wish I had a higher efficiency, but it is what it is. Let's grab this. Whilst I'm digging up this sand, let me take the time to remind you guys that I do have a Discord. I relaunched it earlier this year, and uh, it's just a cool place to hang out. I'm in there quite a bit, talking to you guys, asking about video ideas, posting builds, just keeping you updated, really, on what I'm up to. I think it's great to have a community, you see? Someone to talk to in times of loneliness. Because I get quite lonely myself, you know? Sat here, alone in my room. You guys have helped me through some dark times, I have to say. So thank you very much. The link is in the description below. It'll probably be about here I insert a time lapse of about four hours worth of digging into like 10 seconds. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I'm tired of digging up sand and I have more than enough. Look, I filled this entire chest and I even have some stacks in my inventory. So let's go home. The raft looks so cool at night. The mob farm adds some height to the whole thing, but I just feel like we need something here that looks cool. Oh, I gotta go the other way around. Oops. All right, let's plant this bad boy here. <sighs> I have a disgusting amount of sand, so let's go stick these in the furnaces. Let's wait for all the sand to turn into glass so we can finish up the glass floor. And whilst we wait, I wonder what we can do with this bridge. Is this something we can do with you? I have an idea. It's just gonna involve a fair bit of wood. So let's once again, for like the bajillionth time on this 100 days on a raft, grab some more wood. And we'll fill this whole side in with stairs. All right, now we're done with the stairs. I'm pretty sure I have a moss block kicking around somewhere from a barrel way back when we started. And it stayed on my mind there. Now I'm pretty sure if you bone mill these, they turn everything around it green. And I just feel like I need some more green in my life. Also, while we're here, let's grab the glass. Very, very satisfying to see so much glass in my inventory. I'm running low on coal, though. Mm -hmm. Let's grab some bones from the mob farm. There we go. And that'll make plenty of bone meal. More than enough. Let's extend this. Let's see. All right. Okay. It spreads. This looks really good. This is just what we needed because I just feel like the island was lacking greenery. If this was filled in with glass and this had a wall around it, I think that could look pretty cool. You know what? I might bring this in one more level. So let's do that. Break these slabs. Fill this in with dirt. Fill this in. Yeah, okay. Couple of trees up in this mofo. It's all coming together. Right, let's fill this in with glass so I can freely walk around it because it's annoying me every time I get dunked into the water. Oh, I'm going through some serious amounts of glass. I think I may have underestimated just how much glass I'm going to need for this entire project. All right, let's pop a chest down here because you never know we're going to need storage. Huh. Oh, I have not slept for a couple of days, evidently. Let's jump in bed real quick. All right, we're closing in on the end. Let's hurry things up. Let's finish up this glass floor all the way around the island. I think I want to swap this out for dirt. So it's like you're walking through a gardens. So let's swap all this glass out for dirt, plant the moss blocks, and then make it nice and green. Now we're talking. Look at this. This looks really great. Let's lay down some fence posts. Just adds to the texture of things. We have a very green, healthy, nature-looking area. I've got a little chest in here. I'm sure we can stick some things in there. All right, nice. Before I head into the nether, let's try and get a looting three sword. Just because the wither skeletons ain't be dropping those skulls, bro. So I gotta try extra hard and increase my ch sharpness three again, really? Oh, bro, come on. Oh, now I'm out of XP again. I have to keep going back and forth between here and the mob farm. All right, let's try one more time. What? <laughs> okay, knockback, fire aspect, 
and looting three. You couldn't ask for a better sword. All right, now we have a looting three sword. Getting these skulls is gonna be a little easier. Oh, wow, there's lots of you. I'm being chased, I'm being chased, I'm being chased. Oh, I'm gonna die. Oh, hey, buddy. Oh, get away, get away, get away, get away. I'm gonna die. Eat the potato, eat the potato. Ha ha. Hiya, hiya, hiya. I must be having like the worst luck ever because I cannot tell you how many wither skeletons I've killed and still nothing. Good night, but. <gasps> oh! Look at that. Finally. This seems to be like the area they're spawning, so I'm just gonna keep sticking around here. Finally, we have one skull. Now we just have to try and get two more. Give me your heads. All right, we managed to grab a second one. We just need the final one. How did bro get up there? There we go. We have three skulls, so let's get out of here. Uh, oh, yes, I have the soul sound, too. All right. Oh, that took a disgusting amount of time. Wow. Yo, I love my raft, man. Time to kill the wither. We'll make some strength potions. I have a bunch of shields. Now all we need to do is head underwater and find a good spot to take him out. Unfortunately, I don't have any of mummy's milkies to remove the wither effect. It would be nice to get animals, I'm not gonna lie. I've been keeping my eye out for those chickens that the zombies ride. But uh, thus far, no luck. Let's uh, go as far away from my raft as humanly possible because the last thing I need is the wither breaking up and out of there and destroying all of these 100 days worth of work. I'd say we could do it in this amethyst geode. If I make a long enough tunnel, I spawn the wither in here. I wanna make this quick. I don't wanna spend too much time taking out the wither as I really want to build a beacon. This ain't my first rodeo, I'll be honest with you. Boom and boom, place these down. Come on, we got this. All right, we got him where we want him. Bro is coming at me. Eh, eh. This, why is this taking way longer than usual? Oh no, I'm getting to the end of my tunnel. Die, bro, die, bro. I'm just gonna have to use the sword. Come on, we got this. Oh, just die already, bro. Oh, oh, my heart was racing. Ooh, diamonds. That is a fat vein of diamonds. All right, we got the nether star. Woohoo! We just need to build a beacon now. Boom, beacon crafted. All right, let's put it here. That's it, right? And then you just place the beacon in the middle. Hey! And then I, of course, have diamonds from that huge vein. So what are we saying? Haste, speed, jump boost. I say we get some speed up in here. We got a beacon on the raft. We got a beacon on the raft. Now that we've done that, let's build somewhere where I can organize my storage and place all of the barrels I collected. Hello there. All right, I'm gonna build it here. I just need to get the foundations of it correct as I want to build a sort of sphere and then place a bunch of water in it with fishies in. You didn't think I forgot about that idea, did you? Respiration and depth stride is coming in quite clutch here. I think that's a good size, right? I need to regain some air. One, two, three. As you can tell, I do a lot of counting. One, two, three. One, two. I want this to be more like a tower, like the main house in the middle, but with a giant fish tank on the top of it. I think that would look Cool. Fill this in all the way around. Now we just need to fill this in. Uh, how am I gonna get up the tower? Cause I don't really like the idea of stairs. <laughs> oh, I know. I can just use this and we can put a ladder on it. That's pretty tall, isn't it? Yeah. I need more wood. Sheesh. The speed the beacon's giving me. I'm like the flash, bro. Mine. Neom. Chop. All right, let's get this tower finished. I'm gonna use glass panes, wooden logs to add some pizzazz. This tower's gonna look good. And then I'm gonna add a fish tank to the top. Hopefully this looks okay. Okay, now we have the mini fish tank thing finished. I just need to fill it up with water. So I'll just keep grabbing water from here and keep filling it up. Let's take a step back. What is that meant to be, buddy? What have I aimed for there? That is pretty atrocious. Enjoy your new home. Hey, buddy. You have this whole place to yourself. Wait, what do you mean it looks really bad? Hey, look. Who said I was a Minecraft YouTuber? No one. No one said that. Shh. All right. I think that looks pretty cool. Let's start placing these chests. All right. Let's grab the barrels from the main house. Only trouble here is I'm about to lose a lot of items. Hmm. You know what? We have time. Nothing will despawn as long as I place the barrels quick enough. So, ooh, that's a lot of items. I gotta make this quick. <gasps> My ancient debris. Oh, okay, I have to be super quick. Do not despawn. Where's the other barrels? Any other barrels? I'm sure there was a random one over here somewhere. Where have I moved them? I've moved them. <gasps> quick, 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 quick. 
24 barrels. Pretty decent amount. All right, what we want to do is I'm going to place them all along this wall. Then, when you climb the ladder like this, you can, uh, like this. Eh. Ow. No, what am I trying to do here? I need to, I'm trying to create a floor. That's what I'm trying to do here. Like this. There we go. See? I place these barrels down. And I'll stick all of this stuff in this barrel quickly, quickly, so I don't lose my stuff. We must act with haste! Oh, grab the most important stuff. This. This. Hurry, 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 hurry. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Let's just dump it for now. I'll sort it out in a moment. Yeah, this stuff isn't the most important. We got the main stuff over, like the blaze rather than the nether stuff. Right on. And we shall wait for the sun to set. Let's head over to the villagers. Check they're all okay. You guys are okay. We did some decent trades. I'm going to make you some more beds at some point, guys, so you can reproduce. And there'll be loads of you on the raft. The sun has set. And guys... I hate to break it to you, but it's day 100. So I guess I'll just sort those out in 200 days, if this video does well. Woo! Woohoohoo! We turned a tiny 3x3 three three wooden raft into this spectacular, cozy, homely base of operations. I'm super happy with how this entire raft turned out. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to click the like button and also subscribe for more juicy content. And also, don't forget my Discord. We can just chill out, you know? As always, I've been the Coffee Fuel Genius. Peace. How deep is your love? Is your love? How deep is your love? I really need to know. Cause we're living in a world of two Breaking us down I'm drowning, ah! Oh! Alright, oh, yeah That's exactly what that needed